The Federal Capital Territory High Court in Lube Abuja has fixed June the 16th for the hearing of a case involving one Onyebuchi Ezema, a 35-year-old resident of the FCT, who allegedly raped his four-year-old daughter. The presiding judge, Justice Asamu Akombi Yusuf, fixed the date to allow the accused to have access to an interpreter after his counsel claimed he does not understand the English language. The Make a Difference initiative, popularly known as MAD, had earlier reported the incident to the National Agency for the Prohibition of Trafficking in Persons, NAPTIP, saying the issue is one case too many and called on the federal government to set up a mechanism where victims can access support. The Nigerian government and the Nigerian people must treat rape and other sexual violence, especially child sexual abuse, as a pandemic that must be treated with concerted effort. There must be deliberate and intentional strategy by government and the people to address this issue, else we get to the level that India has got to. It has taken courage for the wife in this relationship to speak up, to ask for help. And we must get people and government to support them in terms of empowering them also. Because the moment you take your husband up on such a matter, you can get really stranded. So we must have support, NGO, civil society, must support the women especially to help out, then support each victim of rape.